Hi, I'm Myung Shin. I work for Egalia. I'd like to introduce the pre site with internet types and WT containers. I work the open month logo in Blink. Why should we use the pre site with internet types? The reason that the C standards don't specify the space size of each internet types and the size of internal types in C can vary based on the compiler and architecture. Chromium supports the various platform with one repository and share the different, the different size of variable uh, among, uh, with the uh, input size with internet types among billboards for real driver. Input size with internet type were changed to precise with the internet types we expected in Blink, but apparently they used to be changed on inspected types like that. So it's not a simple or some machinery works. Sometimes it was required to understand the whole code flow even out of Blink. Finally, we replaced all types in Blink in the second quarter. Yeah. <laughs> Why should you use WTF containers? The reason that WTF's mission is to power and support all other Blink code based by providing fast, reliable, user-friendly, and secure general primitive. And also, we can use WTF containers with garbage collect called it all part. So, STD containers were changed to WTF containers in Blink. So we replaced the all STD containers with the WTF equivalents in Blink in the third quarter. Yeah. <laughs> Basically, we don't allow to use the input side with the types and STD containers listed at the previous page. So we added a pre summary check to make sure not to introduce additional them. But there is an exception here. It's uh, allowed only for the boundary layer needing to de use them between Blink and Chromium. So there is a poor, there is a two options for exception. One is to use a bypass hook when you upload the patch to get it. And another thing is to add the exception node in your patch. Thank you. Thank you very much.